upcoming uh, UK tour as well, and she uh, joins me on the line now. Uh, good afternoon, Janet. Hi. Nice to have you on. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. Good. You're in Sheffield uh, at home now because you, you've had to, to move away, obviously, since things on the X Factor went a bit crazy last year. Yeah. Uh, do you miss you miss home? Yeah. Um, well, I got, I got home there for um, Halloween and, and, and the Michaela gig and stuff. Yeah. That was nice. Up at Casement Park on Saturday. How was that? Of course, a very poignant uh, event and uh, uh, must have been great to be involved with. Oh, definitely. Yeah. It was brilliant. The, the, the turnout it was, it was, it was very good. Yeah. Uh, does it still tingle you a wee bit when you're singing in front of audiences that size as you were at the weekend at, at Casement Park? Because it is completely different from television, isn't it? Oh, yeah, because, um, I mean, in the studio on X Factor, it's only like 500 people. Mm. But I think, I think on Saturday I was more concerned about the audience as well. Yeah, it's fine during at the weekend, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, I just know that through looking sort of through your, your YouTube videos and stuff, I think your current stats there now are well over ten million since you appeared on the the show uh, yeah. last year. To to think that you know you've had ten million hits of your music on on YouTube, that's a bit crazy, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. I mean, before the show, I think I was on like twenty thousand. Yeah, incredible. Jump to ten million is like not. Apart from the fact that you now live in Sheffield and not Gorchin, uh, how else has your life transformed in the past year, Janet? Um, well, it's, it's been brilliant, really. I mean, um, I've managed to find myself in a very, very lucky position that I get to make a career out of something that I actually enjoy and, you know, and I get, I get a write songs and, and wake up and know that that's my job. Really good. <laughs> I mean, there are, there are harder ways of earning a living. That's what I always say to people in here when they complain, you could be digging a ditch, you know, especially in the cold weather as well. Uh, somebody texted me earlier in and uh, earlier on and asked uh, which of your, your new songs you'd be most looking forward to performing on the, the up and coming tour because you have got a very early stages of the new album coming together. It doesn't yet have a name, but uh, what can we expect on, on that album and uh, what are you looking forward to belting out? Probably 
not your most favourite element of it. Um, would you, knowing what you know now, would you go back through it all again? Well, I, I don't think I have the physical energy to do that the show again. Mm. Like, obviously, but I mean, I wouldn't change it for the world. Like, I wouldn't go back in and not do it. Definitely not. Because, I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be in a privileged position that I'm in now. Talking through the uh, the tour, Janet, uh, quite a lot of dates uh, coming up. Uh, hopefully you're going to kick that off in, uh, is the, the tour starts in March, isn't that right? Yes. Okay. Tickets went on sale uh, nationally this morning from uh, Ticketmaster.ie uh, and uh, quite a few uh, quite a few local uh, Irish dates. You're going to be over here touring as well, yeah? Yeah, definitely. Where are you going to be? Um, the, the OER Centre in Belfast, um... Kind of that for sure. And then there's Galway, Dublin, and Cork. Okay. Yeah. I mean, even Derry as well. Uh, fingers crossed as well, because I know we've got a got a lot of listeners there who would quite like to see you. So fingers crossed that one can get its way onto the onto the, the bill as well. Uh, the Irish dates uh, went on sale this morning, nine o'clock. Get your tickets and see this uh, young lady uh, live in uh, concert, uh, Janet Devlin. Many congratulations on your success over the past year. Uh, good luck with the album and indeed the uh, the tour as well. We hope it does really well for you. And uh, thanks for joining me on the show this morning or this afternoon. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, and you know what? We've got to play. Uh, I guess we've got to play your song. Can I have permission to play your song? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because it, because it is your song. It's not my song. It's your song. I'm gonna I'm gonna play it. Uh, I'm gonna play it right now, Janet. Thanks for joining me. Bye.
Yep, that was the uh, song that millions watched her on The X Factor last year get through the audition stage, or Janet, Janet Devlin, uh, with her version of Elton John's uh, Your Song. Thanks to Janet for joining me on the line there uh, from home in Sheffield this afternoon. She has just announced she's going on tour. She's got an album coming out as well. It's all going to happen in 2013 for the young Gorchin girl. Uh, tickets for her national uh, tour, by the way, went on sale uh, this morning at nine. You can pick those up now if you would like to uh, see Janet in uh, one of those venues across Ireland uh, during early part of 2013. Good luck to her as well. Right, coming up at uh, almost half past 12 this afternoon.